Let's let's get rid of the. <laughs> no, let's try it. Oh, let's oh, get the committee oh, assignments out of the way here because I think that's going to be a quick one. Okay. Well, before before Pam left, she was starting to make all these. The, as you can see, there's some errors in here. Right. Right. Uh, Tom was on the solid water board. Oh, no, waster. Waster. He was on yeah. the waster board, and you were on the water board, weren't you? Um, no, he no was I was on the water, water board. board. Yeah. Anyway, boarding. Water she was clear. Yeah. Don't she was you know, waterboarding. Just not no waterboarding. Water no, I know. That's what they may say that, but we don't waterboard here. So, so anyway, um, yeah, I, I was just trying to clean up some of this language. Sure. So, um, as far as I was concerned on this, I'm. Don is on emergency management now, hey, hey. so that should have been changed. And I made an error to that, yes. Okay, okay. and then I'll hospital board there. nomination committee is no longer in operation, so that's off, and I'm on redevelopment. And that's off. Right. Okay, and I had investment board, but is that, is that kind of over here, though? Yes, that's an That's easy. more yeah. more over here. Okay. okay. All right. Um, I didn't have a problem with. Well, we're all on the board of finance. Building maintenance and security. If you want me to keep it, I will. Highway. If you want me to keep it, I will. Fee committee. Ditto. I am on the region three, and and that'll be scratched out and changed to region three executive board. Solid waste board. Health board. And then the name of that, that last committee is not the EMS Strategic Planning Committee, it's the EMS Oversight Committee. And I can or cannot stay, I don't really, I really don't care whether I stay on that one or not. If you don't mind, I think we'll just keep you on that. And Tom? You would. Anything? No, I'll take redevelopment off. Is there anything oh, you can have anything that went off the line? Oh, highway. Here's highway. You can have you know, that one. <laughs> How about planning commission? I've got the joint advisor. Yeah. Well, I would take the planning commission before I take the drainage board. <laughs> you, you keep them both one more year. So you You're welcome to have either one of them. Uh, uh, I don't want to take stuff away from you. No, I, you two guys jumped on those like icing on a cake, if I remember. <laughs> Yeah. But if things Are get too numerous, I know Don's got a new job with the state now. I don't know how much time that's going to take, but finding out in education, those jobs oh, won't be won't be many meetings or anything. Yeah. <laughs> Start out with um, executive committee for uh, for, for the, the state AICC. for the uh, AIC. <laughs> for the AIC. Yeah. So those jobs yeah. seem to Woo. seem to grow when you're willing. Uh, <coughs> district meetings and everything else. So, you know, but if you find out that too yeah, much is, is time is taken away from my, if you want to sit down and talk, we'll see. All right. Otherwise, it'll yeah. remain the same. Okay. Console trying to make their changes tomorrow. <coughs> All right. Uh, next, we'll deal with the CETA plan, the final CETA plan, and, and uh, why don't we deal with that, Don? That's your baby. Let's now, when we met, I don't have a date right in front of me. We, we, we did a work day on uh, Wednesday, and, and we pretty much, pretty much massaged it until um, Brandon... So Brandon came to us about the, uh, yeah, in our December 17th meeting, we decided to add what essentially is Project 13, which is assist with the replacement plan of, assist, assist with the replacement of Bridge 10. Um, I believe, and I'm sorry, I should have asked Brandon, I believe the, the estimated cost was 215000 plus on that. Um, the other source of funding would be Cube Bridge Fund. Production, or sketch, construction in 13, and, and we agreed to put 100000 towards that. 
So if you then go down to the to the the bottom line then is we are still short of our 75 percent uh, for 13 by $82,903 or 83000 if you like the rounding. So, and 14 were way off. But you know what I quickly learned is, geez, guys, I know it may be a two year plan. Oh, by the way, <coughs> Huntington is like a three or four year plan. I don't know. Well, really? You can't go out that far. I, I mean, I'm sorry, they do, and I don't mean. That's a personal Huntington. I don't mean that. I'm just saying, though, that how, how can you do that? When, when I struggled with 14, you know, I, I, and I think, so I think the thing to do, or at least it was my, my thoughts here, is let's really deal with 13. Let's really try to get some good numbers for 13, right. 14 numbers only because it says it's a two-year plan. So. so that's my recommendation is, um, is that we take this to the council. Discussion on that? Is that, is that a motion? Yeah. Or I'll, we, I'll second it for the discussion. Yeah, go ahead. We got a motion or we got a uh, second with discussion? Is is this our ending balance? 822-635 at the end of the year. Is that what we set? For our ending amount, that's the only question. And if you figure it out, I just yes. want to be sure that's it the is. that's mm -hmm. the amount you were working with. And, and that is the ending, yes. And that is the amount, amount I was working with. Okay. Um, okay, I can answer that. Okay, I can answer that. Give me a second here. Thank you. Uh, I was thinking was I I worked with a number less than that because well, my assumption fine. my assumption had to be that we would spend all of the two hundred and fifty thousand dollars in on-site off-site what we did okay in fact I think we only spent twenty five thousand out there so so there would be a 225 to, I think I was thinking more like 500,000 to be real honest but I, I think I have a number here of 573 788 and I think that's the number I was working with so somewhere well over yeah, yeah. okay and the other item is uh, in the in the uh, project 8 and this this can be honest nothing big but uh, 2014 37 3 and 5 add up to 45,000, we have 50,000 in there. So we can add another 5,000 into the program or make that 50, 45. It's a minor I, deal, but I just, you know, there again. My, my choice would, uh, uh, I, I, I remember what happened. I had originally a Let me go back to a, an earlier. That's, the fourth That's exactly why I marked all these different graph numbers so I could go back. Yes, and, all four. And then it doesn't necessarily have to be Project 8 because they can change too. Oh, yeah, and it's 2014. I just case anyone. Uh, I, it looks to me like just a bad job of addition. That's what it's looking like to me. But give, well, me give me a couple more chances here. I, uh, there's a second draft. 
That's their problem in Washington. It's a bad case of that issue. <laughs> I think. Do we have one, do you want to tell them who my principal was when I learned to hand? <laughs> uh -uh. <laughs> no, that's not a knock. No, 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 that's not a knock. I just. It's just ironic, though. That's okay. Uh, I'm just saying, make a note. My suggestion is know. that we change that to forty-five thousand. But, 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 and in doing so, and I won't have time to do that before tomorrow. But in doing so, then that's going to change the. the I know. Don't worry. Last. I just want it to be in case State Board of Accounts. Yeah, I got gotcha. you. Because it doesn't add. You're absolutely right. And what I was confused with was uh, over here on Project Ten. Yes. We had 5,000 miscellaneous, and I think in my head yeah. I had that 5,000 miscellaneous over here. So, mm -hmm. so, okay. so that the bottom line there is, does that add up? 35, 39, 8, 44, 8. Yep, that adds yeah. up. So, okay. I, I'm going to say, sir, it's just an addition. That's the only one I can okay. find. Sorry, right. outside of that. Okay. Right. okay. I guess you have a motion. Second. Okay, we got a motion and a second. All in favor? Raise your right hand. Goes the same. Okay. I'm going to see it. Okay, I think we've got everything on the agenda here. Uh, Randy Dellinger, did you have something? Yes, sir. Um, after, and John's gone now, after our last meeting, I walked over. Well, yeah, literally, after our meeting. I, I walked over, you did. and I believe that that's a perfect spot. It, it, none of his objections were, were accurate. The objection that he had to take people through a, a crowded office, no. It has a complete, its own, its own entrance. It even has an entrance from the outside of the jail. You would never have to see anybody. And additionally, the chief of probation showed me an area just outside the office with a kitchen table and chairs and said the only time we really use this is when we have baby showers. <coughs> and so he baby. could, yeah, they, might, they have, may have a baby luncheon. She said her point was he could, he could, take the whole families out and put them around that table and it's private. Nobody would ever, you know. All right. So consequently, John Barrett did exactly the same thing. And, and he's not here and I understand that, but his thoughts were exactly the same. We did it independent. I didn't know he was going to look. He didn't know I was going to look. But, but he did go look and he came up with the exact same thing I did. It's a perfect place for him. Yeah. It, it, it really meets all the qualifications. Okay, that said, we didn't do anything about that car. So I can only tell you, I can only give you my opinion. A, a vehicle, well, first of all, we've, we've never given the coroner a vehicle. Never. So I question the, the need there. Secondly, to give them a vehicle with to take a vehicle out of the sheriff's department service with 81,000 miles is just strikes me as too early. The sheriff honestly didn't care much one way or the other, whether we did or not. But if pushed, he would say, yeah, it's probably too early. So uh, I don't, I, I don't, I couldn't support giving him a car. I really can't. So, but that's just me. So. Okay. Um, and in fact, I, I'll make a, I, I will make a motion that we don't, that we don't give him a car, and uh, you can second it or let it die for lack of second. I don't really care. Got a motion? I'll second. Got a second? Discussion? All those in favor, right hand. Opposed the same. Um, so I see no need to take it for cancel. No. And as far as the the building or the office. I went over there Friday, and it's, okay. it's a great area. I, I, I'm telling you, it, 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 it matched everything he wanted. And, it, and what didn't make sense was he didn't have to take them through the jail lobby. He doesn't, 
doesn't have to take them through the probation office. I, I don't know where he, I don't know where he got the idea, and I, I'm sorry that he had that idea. <coughs> How about anything from the public? Anything? You might have just been looking at the wrong office. <laughs> I, 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 you know what? That is really, really true that he might have been looking at the wrong office. I don't, I can't answer. I don't know. Yeah, George, I do have one statement to make. When those planning commission openings uh, were available several months ago, uh, there was no requirement for, other than just throwing your name in the hat, there was nothing about qualifications or time, as, as Tom indicated now. Um, I would suggest that, that you, you put down a, a criteria list for the next time that something like that is available. Sure, no, I agree. <clears throat> Your thought? No, that that's fine. I didn't mean I had to have a license in planning or anything. But <laughs> it's uh, you know it's it's a point well taken. List your criteria to you know give qualification your qualification for yeah. the job or something in there. Sure. And if they've had experience of being on it once before or moving into the county from another county, why that would be things that. Would the commissioners don't appoint every member of the commission? Uh, okay. Right? Right. No. Mm -hmm. So we don't want rules for our appointees. Here's where I'm going with this. We should go back to the plan commission director and say, we would like you to see you institute a policy by which we will advertise there's an opening. And if you're interested, send a, send in your name and this information. Because we don't we don't appoint, and I, I think all appoint all appointees, regardless of who appoints them, should go under the same. That's same. probably a good idea. I'd like to have them work through the Dave Sewell's office. Then when he gets them, he can. Well, but some of those are uh, political appointees, right? Mm, I don't believe so. Well, because typically, is it not the surveyor gets one because he is the surveyor or his appointed representative? Uh, and the Purdue representative is appointed because he is the county agent, right? I guess you could talk about that. Yeah, I was hung up on your, your calling it political. You mean. By virtue of holding one office, you are right. Okay, right. we have we have to be on the solid waste board. Right. Right. It's just by virtue of being a commissioner. Yeah. Okay. 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 Because I thought you meant you had to be oh, a Republican no, or a Democrat. No, 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 no. Okay. That's okay. what I was saying. Yeah. That, I'm sorry, Henry. You just you just kind of threw me with that one. You're right on that. Yeah. But there are cases where the law states, yeah, because you're the this is your position. Yeah. Yeah. And you have to go do this. Right. Do you have do you have jurisdiction by by because due to the fact that you are county commissioners, mm -hmm. can you say something as county commissioners that regardless of what board it is within the county, this is the this is the procedure we'd like to see you follow? Then that takes in whether, it's, so, a, whether it's a BZA or whether it's a plan commission or whether it's a city commission. Can you say that for all of the county that this is the commit, this is the procedure we'd like to see followed for appointed for appointed, appointed positions? Yeah. I'm not sure. We couldn't um, do that for the chair of Busco plan commission. We couldn't do that for the South Whitley plan commission. I'm sure of that. The only thing I would say the only contact we would have that. The Whitley County Plan Commission, Mr. Sewell, does now kind of oversee the chair bus going south with the plan committee. He goes to their meetings where three or four years ago he did. Okay. And Columbus but City. Does he go to Columbus City? Well, he's, he is the county and city plan. Okay, so, so out of his office we might be able to. That's where it would have to happen. If Mr. Sewell was adamant that wasn't going to happen, that would just be between us and him. Yeah, we we'll just yeah. drop it. He might have a better way. Yeah. I I think this looks kind of like the tip of 